Welcome back to the channel. This is Sharpen Up episode 10, Mediterranean Mooring. So the first thing I want to make very clear about this is when I do a Mediterranean Mooring, I pre-drop a select depth of anchor so that I can very easily place my anchor exactly where I want it to be. So you'll notice here that we pre-drop about 12 meters so that when we're in position in reverse, we can get the anchor on the seabed. Here is the raw footage and audio from this maneuver. You keep going over. Until you're straight, straight over. Keep going. But that one's from here, no? Yeah, but like that, look, look at his angle. His, the dock, it, so straight out from the dock, you want to drop your anchor over here. Okay. Yeah. So you need to keep going over I'll a little bit. Up. Yeah. And then, and then curve, curve around. I'm okay. My 15 meters. All right. What, what is your depth? Now. 16. Now go straight. 16. Yeah. So now go straight to the dock because you've got a good line. Okay. So put 10, go down to 10 meters, Dimitri. Okay, you can still, still come over just a tiny bit. That's it. And see with the stern into the wind, we have plenty of control. Okay, 10 is down. So now straight towards the dock. Okay, straight towards the dock. And now we decide when we're going to put the anchor on the ground. I will do it now. Okay, but we don't have enough chain. You think, how far is that? That's 60 meters to yeah. the dock. We've already got 10 down and it's not even on the bottom. So just wait. What's our depth now? 15. 15. So we keep going. Okay, so now get him down to... Now we're 15. 16. We've got 10 meters down, so that's all right. Okay. Let's tell him to drop 15. So he did get it to 15 meters deep. So five more meters down. I'll throw it for me. Okay. And now, and now yep, you watch your line over to over to quarter bit, and now just tell him to keep dropping. Okay, I'll drop it on me. Yeah, yeah, keep dropping, keep dropping, go, keep go, 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 go. Yeah. Because now it's on the ground, and we want to pay it out slowly. Keep dropping. Seventeen. Keep dropping. Just continual dropping now. Keep going, keep going. And slow down a little if you can, because you're pulling on the anchor now. Now I'm neutral. Like, no, you need to stay, stay and go, go back into reverse then. You've got to keep, okay. keep going. I have 18 meters. Okay, deep. Yeah. Oh, wow. How much you've got out? Uh, meters. Okay, keep going. Check your thrusters are still working. Just, just tap them. Okay, get them back on. How much now? Okay, hold. How is the angle? How is the angle? Straight down. So we're just waiting for it to come up. Tell us when it starts coming up. Okay. Starting to build tension, leave it in gear, leave it in gear. You're okay. Leave it in gear. And see now it's starting to slow us and it's starting to build tension. Okay, so now it's almost stopped us. Give us another three meters. Well, back right now. Uh, keep it in, just keep it in gear. No, 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 no. Just keep it in gear, not okay. power. Okay, bow thrust to start it. Bow, bow, bow. The bow thrust to start it, yeah. On. Yep. That's that, yeah. Okay, you can't just keep pressing it, we do it without. Two more meters, Dimitri. Yes, yep. they just forget about it. Now you've got no thrusters. Okay, so now at this point, alright, you want to, if you've got no thrusters, yep. we need to get over them. So, same theory, over, hard to start it. We kick the stern over a bit with a push, it kicks over, and now we're going to reverse. Our anchor chain is still the same place, yep. and now central, 
central rudder and we're going to back up in that direction okay another two meters Tension. Okay. Coming up? No. Okay, that's all good. But we know we had a good hold. So now, the tension will stop it maybe, but we don't have to have the tension stop it. We can stop it. Come back to you. Back into reverse. Into reverse. Just click. Just click. Just click. Yeah, so go neutral. Toy top. Yeah. 